go to the clinical common sense and observe this case. A lot of implant, recent treatment. Do you put implant with this type of uh, posterior interference here? Yeah. With this type of uh, uh, wear situation of the anterior teeth, how is the guiding function here? Yeah. And how is the braxis for this patient? Perhaps we have to control it before putting an implant with an excessive curve P on the left part with a completely flat, 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 flat occlusal plane reversed in the inclination. Everything is wrong here, but it is nice implant. But understanding of occlusion is zero. Look at the axis of the implant here, like this. And the direction of the force is like this. Remember, there are risks, of course. But the first risk is to ignore occlusion.